Hey everyone, my name is Riley and in this video I'm going to show you the easiest way to build a Shopify dropshipping store using AI. This AI tool is going to do all of the product research to find us winning products to promote. It's then going to actually build the entire store for us. So all we have to do is go in there, maybe tighten up the copy a little bit, make a few changes here and there. I'm going to show you all of this step by step, so let's jump right in. Okay, so the tool that we will be using to do this is this tool right here called Auto. AutoDS. Now, if you use the top link in the description when signing up for AutoDS, it's going to take you over to this page. And this is going to allow you to get this crazy deal, which is a 14 day trial for only $1. So once you are on this page, just click on start dropshipping right here. And then we can sign up for an AutoDS account. So you can either fill in your information or just sign up with a Google account. And then once we are signed up, it's going to ask us where we want to sell. Now, obviously we want to go for Shopify. So I'm going to select Shopify and then we can choose our plan right here. Now, as a beginner, if this is your first time building a dropshipping store and you haven't had a profitable dropshipping store yet, then we can go for this cheapest plan right here. Essentially, it's just going to allow you to import more products with these higher plans. So let's go for this one. Start now for 99 cents. Then we can enter in our payment details and click on continue. Just like that, I am now inside of AutoDS. I now have my account. So we can exit out of this and click up here onto add store. So we can add store and then we have three options. We can either say we already have a Shopify store, connect it to AutoDS. We do not want this. And we can also create our own Shopify store. We don't want this one either. So look at this, use AI to generate a pre-built Shopify store and it's going to do all of the product research for us. So this is the plan that we want to go for. Click on continue. And now we can select our niche. So we can either build a brand in fashion and apparel, electronics and gadgets, home and garden, pets, sport and fitness, or I'm not sure. And in this example, let's go for home and garden. So I'm going to build my store around the home and garden niche. So once you have selected the niche to build your store around, we can click on next. And right here, the AI is now going to build the store for us. Just like that, in literally seconds, I now have my login details that I can use to get into my brand new Shopify store that AutoDS has just created. So now all I'm going to do is open up Shopify, then click on login right here. And now all I have to do is go here and copy the email and paste this into the email, continue with email, and then go back and grab the password as well and paste that into here. Then I can log in. And just like this, I now have my brand new Shopify account. So the only thing that we have to do before we actually go in and start making changes and looking at the store is actually select a plan as this is going to unlock the store and allow us to get access and allow us to drive traffic. So we can click up here on select a plan. And then we have basic Shopify advanced and plus. And the awesome thing about this is going through auto DS in the method that we just have we basically get the extended trial of Shopify. So as you can see, usually this is like $29 per month, $79 per month and $299 per month. But all of these we can get for just $1 for the first month. Now, once again, as a beginner, we only need the basic right here. So just select basic. Then we can enter in our card information. And basically this is going to be a dollar for the first month, which is with this method, more than enough time to start seeing your first sales come in. So once we have selected that plan, let's now go down to the online store. And then in here, we can see automatically, we have been given this pre-built AI Shopify store. So let's click on these three dots and preview this to see what the store is actually going to look like. And right here, we can see our store. So right off the bat, there is definitely a few things that we need to change here. Right here, this banner, I don't really like this and we are going to have to change this, but I'll walk you through all of this process step by step. But most importantly, let's go down and see some of the products that they have chosen for us. So definitely not all of these are going to be winners, but this is definitely an awesome product. It's like a wine pourer. This could also be a very nice product as well. This for sure. Okay, so this is probably the one that I'm going to focus on. This is like an outdoor electric lamp. And let's see if there's any more. 
Okay, so this is definitely the one that I would be focusing on right here. And this is where I'm going to send all of my traffic. This is the main product that I would be focusing on with this store. This is the product that I would use to promote on TikTok, on Instagram, on all of these social media platforms. So this is the one that I'm going to focus on. So let's now back out and go back to the main Shopify dashboard. And then I'm going to go into products over here. And let's just go down and find that exact product right here. So let's click on this. And this is essentially a mosquito trap. So it's going to turn on a light and then kill all of the mosquitoes in the area. So what I'm going to do is just open up a new tab and we need to create an awesome name for this. So I'm going to head over to ChatGPT. This is a completely free AI tool. And then in here, we can ask ChatGPT and we can say, create me a brand name for a mosquito trap light. Actually, I'm going to say, create me 10 brand names so we have a few to choose from and then in here we can literally choose from any of these so i really like this lumina trap i'm going to go for this lumina trap and then all i'm going to do is paste this in here lumina trap mosquito lamp just like that then what i also like to do on my drop shipping stores just to give it an extra touch of professionalism is go here and just for the tm logo and then we can copy this and paste this in right here so that looks a lot more professional already. Then we can click on save. And this product description we will come back to later on. It doesn't really look professional right now. But the main thing that I want to focus on is the media. And then all of these, we can essentially find a lot better images than the images that we are given right here. So all I'm going to do is just go down and remove all of these images, just like this. And then all I'm going to do is go to Google and type in mosquito lamp plus Shopify. And then this is going to bring up a load of different Shopify stores that are selling this exact same lamp. So we can look through and we can find some awesome product images from these. So right here, I've essentially pulled up four different Shopify stores that are selling the exact same product. So this one has pretty bad product images. This one's a lot better. Okay, pretty nice. This one also has terrible images, so we will get rid of that. And then this one is awesome. Okay, so I'm definitely going to be using some of these. So this one is awesome. I'm just going to open this up and then save this image. Let's create a new file and say mosquito trap. And then we can create this. And then we will save this image to this. Then I don't really like this one. This one is awesome. So we will save this one as well. I like this one. No noise. Uh, this one's not the best. This one we will save as well. Save that right there. And then this one showing all of the dead mosquitoes. This is awesome. So we can save this. And then this one I will save as well. And then the final thing that I'm going to swipe here is just this little GIF. So we can save this image right here. And that is now saved as a GIF. And then any from these. Okay, so I'll save this as well. And perfect. So I now have all of the product images that I want to add in. So I'm just going to go back to my media, upload new. And then I don't want the gifts. I just want everything apart from the gifts. So these two are the gifts and then everything in between I can add in. And then I want to make sure that this one is right at the front right here. This looks beautiful. And then maybe we can go for uh, this. Then this. No noise. Perfect. So we now have all of the product images right here. And then the gifts are actually going to come in handy right here in the description. So what I'm going to do is just copy all of this, this kind of mini description at the top. Then we can head over to chat GPT. So I'm going to say, create me a product description for this product and paste that in right there. And then look at this. It's going to give us a beautiful product description in literally seconds. So we have key features. We have why choose our bug killer lamp, the specifications, what the package includes. So then all we have to do is copy all of this right here. Paste this into the description on Shopify so we can go back over and just delete all of this right here. We have a long description. Nobody is going to be reading this. So let's just go up and delete this. Then we can paste in our new beautiful description. And then what I'm going to do is add in the GIFs just up here. So this one can go at the top. We can add this in right here. Beautiful. And then the second one, I also want to add in just under underneath here. Then we can add the second one in just like that. 
Then the last thing that we want to change is the price. So the way that we do this is we want to go over to AliExpress as this is where we will be getting the product from. And we want to search for Mosquito Killer. It's definitely spelled wrong, but we can see right here, we can essentially buy this for £2.23. This is probably like $2.50, $2.70. And although this markup is pretty nice, I think we could sell this for like $24.99. That's a much better price. So actually what I'm going to do is this doesn't have any variants. It's only going to come in white. So we just want to go down and delete these variant options. And then we can go up to the price. Price this at $24.99. And then we will say this is at a bit of a discount from $39.99. And then from here, we can simply go up and click on save. And if we now click on preview to see the product page where we will be sending people, this looks absolutely awesome. So we can see the product right here, as well as all of the images along the bottom. We can also see the description that we just added in using AI as well. And this is a super professional product page that I just created in like five to 15 minutes. So right here, we could now go out and start promoting this product. But the last thing that we need to do is just go in here and make a few changes. So all I'm going to do is exit out of this. Then we can go back to online store and then click on customize and we can start editing this homepage. Now, honestly, the homepage is not as important as long as we have an awesome product page like we just created. Not many people are going to actually go to this homepage. So this part, it doesn't really matter as much. However, we do want to make the website as professional as possible. So let's click on here and edit this image so we can click on change. Then select three images. Let's go for type in home. And then maybe we can go for something like this. That already looks a lot better. And what I'm basically going to do is just focus on the main product that we just created. So the featured collection, we want to delete. Then this collection list, we can delete as well. Have a question is awesome, but all I'm going to do is add a section in right here. And I'm actually going to go for a featured product. So now that is added in, let's just move this above to like right here. Then we can select the product and we want to go for the mosquito lamp that we just created. And boom, that looks a lot better. And just like that, we now have this added in. Then have a question. This is actually not looking too good. So let's choose an image. We will go for home again. Then we can choose from one of these. Maybe we can go for like this. Awesome. So this is just a super quick method of doing this. If I spent more time, I would look through for slightly better images, but already this looks super, super professional. So on the homepage, we now have this section. We have this section that shows off the product. We have this contact us section, and we also have an email newsletter that people can sign up to. And just like that, the store is built. So once again, this just looks absolutely fantastic. I'm super pleased with how this turned out, especially this product page for the product we are focusing on. And that is how you can create a Shopify store using AI. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.